Hi, my name is Aaron Hamilton, and this is Truck and True Vlogs, episode 15. What is it? What's going on, YouTube? Welcome back to another episode of Truck and Truth Vlogs, episode 15. Now today is the day. Now when y'all see this, it'll be Friday. But right now, for me, it's Monday. I mean, it really is Monday. That's the day I'm recording this. But today is the day. Today is the day. Now I, I set my wife up. She don't know it yet, but uh, I got her a little surprise. It comes with two cards. Okay. If if we find out today that our baby is a boy, okay, one of the cards is going to say. Well, the card for the boy is going to say, you got me. And if uh, we find out that our baby is a girl, the card is actually going to say, ha, told you so. But I saw in this particular vlog, in this particular everything, I'm not only just going to share my life with you, which is what I've been wanting to do, but I'm going to do it with a little bit of style. I'm going to challenge myself to make this the best freaking vlog I've ever made in my life, okay? This is uh, what my career as a photographer and videographer, to me, depends on. So, that's what I'm doing. But right now, I gotta run a couple of errands, okay? So, follow along. So I had to drop off some paperwork. Now I gotta pay for some parking. Yeah, because my, my yard's a little overcrowded, so. Girl, so I'll see you inside. All right. So, turn in my paperwork, make sure I get paid, pay for parking. Now, on my way to Mickey D's. Oh yeah, boy, I gotta get the hash browns for the pregnant lady, let's go. I get uh, four hash browns, a large orange juice, and then can I also get uh, and what do I want? Oh, can I also get uh, two sausage and egg, uh, um, McMuffins, and a large Coke. These guys made me pull all the way up because I have to wait for the hash browns to get done. Ain't that some shit? So this is a good time for a vape break. Hold on. Wait, I got the vape. I got the vape. <sighs> had to take it. Had to do it. I just realized I had a whole bunch of eye boogers or eye crud, whatever y'all want to call it, in my eyes. I just realized that. How come y'all didn't tell me I had a whole bunch of eye boogers and shit in my eyes? Hold on. And now I'm on my way back home. But, uh, all the police is out here. I might want to put my seatbelt on. I'm just saying. I hate seatbelts. Now, I'm going to give y'all a little bit of advice about when y'all married. And this is like for dudes. And I could be wrong, but to all my married fellas out there that's got some years, behind their marriage because I ain't really been married that long. I only been married, this would be my fourth year anniversary this November. So I know one of the things that uh, personally makes a lot of difference in my marriage uh, is, is doing small things. It's doing really small things. Not only is today like a big surprise for y'all, you know, being part of my life and finding out whether or not today I'm going to have a boy or girl. But also today, you know, I'm just doing a lot of small surprises things for the lady. You know what I'm saying? But what she doesn't know is that I got her the edible arrangements like I told y'all in the beginning of the video. 
and she don't even know that I'm out here you know I got her hash browns okay now it doesn't sound like it's a lot and it's really cheap it is okay but my wife literally loves hash browns and she doesn't know that I got her some you know so I got her some hash browns and some orange juice that's just to put a little smile on her face and stuff like that I got her the edible arrangements it's chocolate cover so she can eat it so hopefully my baby is in in the uh in the ultrasound just jumping around that we can find out if it's got a penis or a vagina I'm begging for a girl but my wife is always right so we'll see we'll see can't get the hole babe can you can you help me That's why I know how I trust your feelings. Yeah. It's that like intuition. If you didn't trust it before, you trust it now, don't you? I always trust it. I know, but I'm saying if you ever had any ounce of doubt. <laughs> That means she's right all the goddamn time. <laughs> We're having a boy. We having a boy. I'm gonna be in the backyard playing catch. Okay? I'm gonna have a little look-alike that looks okay, like is this me. 28th Street? Yeah. Yep, it's 28th Street. Alright, all right, so we having a boy. She's always right. This is why I just keep my damn mouth shut all the damn time now. Cause I'm tired of always being wrong. <laughs> but we having a boy! So exciting. So I'm definitely glad y'all get to be a part of this journey. So this is actually what we getting ready to do right now. Now we're in Best Buy. Told you. So now we are basically getting some stuff. So that way we can announce the fact that we're having a boy. And uh, put it on Facebook and everything. So believe it or not, YouTube, you guys knew before all my other social media platforms that I'm at having a boy. So we at Baby's R Us right now. Look it. Guilty 718. Look, man, I had you in the back of the mind, and since because, you know, man, you, we basically kind of the same, you know, 
no filters or anything like that. I decided one of the very first things I'm gonna buy my son is something that I think is gonna have your inspiration behind it. Check this out. So I'm going to have a boy. That is amazing. I'm going to have a son, man. So hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Hopefully you guys seen a lot more um, that put into the video and stuff like that. And hopefully you guys are also as, as excited as my wife and I are. Just the fact that I'm about to be a father and being able to hear my son's heartbeat and stuff like that is freaking amazing. As of right now, I'm not going to tell you guys what we are naming our son, okay? Um, just know his last name is going to be Hamilton, but his nickname is Freight Shaker, okay? There's, there's a reason why I'm naming him Freight Shaker. And for those who don't know, Freight Shaker is another word for Freight Liner. So, um, but anyway, I'm just, I'm happy. You have no idea how I'm happy. My wife is happy too. She said that uh, she feels like all of her dreams came true because she always get what she wants. You guys heard her. She's a... She's a psychic, you know what I mean? Basically, she knew, just knew that she was having um, a boy, that she's going to bear a son of mine into the world. She just knew it, you know? But believe it or not, believe it or not, she planned, or I ain't going to say planned it all out, but she said basically what she wanted, at what age, and what time and how things are going to go. And when I sit here and I say it is literally, literally been that way, it has been that way. But needless to say, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Be on the lookout for episode 16 dropping next week. I appreciate you guys rocking with me. I now, at this time, when you guys see this video, I've, I'm now over 320 subscribers. It definitely means a lot to me. It definitely means a lot to me. So, yeah, I'm a big daddy. I'm, a, I'm having a boy. Yes. Man, appreciate it. I definitely, definitely appreciate all the love and support. So, anyway, I'm about to get up out of here. I got, I'm back at work, so... I got some things to do. Deuces.